Welcome to Teki the uh, Mini MBA Brief. I'm DBC Ikegwe. I just finished a, a meeting with one of our members for Teki the Start of Masterclass. In one of our courseware materials, I noted that startups in Africa should not overly focus on competition. That the biggest competition has to be internal, having the capacity to do what that startup said it to do. In other words, you have a specific goal to go into the market to fix a friction which customers have. Are you delivering on that promise? If you are delivering on that promise, I will tell you something that the future is going to be promising. Because the difficulty in here is this, that most times people get so fixated with the competition that they begin to lose that they are not even doing what they said they would do. There is one clear problem, but there are also many ways to go and attack that problem. More than a century ago, First Bank of Nigeria started banking operations to offer financial services to customers. He developed a model. He pursued it. He found sources. But decades later, new generation banks in Nigeria, like Old Diamond Bank, GT Bank, Zeni Bank, they all came. They did not specifically recreate the same parts that Face Bank took. They created a new basis of competition, found their own parts, and they found Sussex. If you look at the whole thing, the same Face Bank, the GT Bank, Zenith Bank, they were all going for the same thing, proving the efficiency in the financial services sector. So, my point is this. Even though the friction could look similar, the way you go to attack them may not necessarily be the same thing. That is the reason why the greatest companies on earth, they figure out how to create a new basis of competition. A new basis of competition is basically the construct that you are now offering something to customers well beyond for any level of comparison with what the other people are doing. So it doesn't mean that you have to wake up in the morning and be so fixated on what the competitor should be doing. Rather, it's about what are you actually doing as a company. Our markets are still largely at the level of infancy. We've not gotten into that level of saturation. Where disruption may become exceedingly very difficult for us to achieve. So what you really need to do most times is to figure out a path and you go and pursue it. But that path must not necessarily be an expired path. What First Bank did more than a century ago has expired. And even what GT Bank did many decades ago has expired. That is the reason why when Minten came into the scene, a pioneered his own path, building a Pindodo kind of business model within the banking ordinance. When Flora Wave came, a pioneer is on part. When Paystar came, if you look at everything, they are still offering financial services. So you go back into the market. You ask yourself a question. I have known this friction. I have seen this friction. And I have got the capabilities to create products and services by organizing factors of production to go and provide a solution in the market. Am I really doing that thing very well? Or is it every morning unfeasated in what the competition is doing? The competition you have to worry about is not the other guy. It's not the other startup. It's you. If you can overcome that and deliver on the promises you've made, I promise you the markets in Africa will have moments for you. Thank you.